Hello, I'm Ken with Orion Telescopes and Binoculars, and in this video I wanted to talk about the Starseeker line of telescopes. Now we've got a bunch. There's uh, three models of reflectors, three models of Maksutov designs. Uh, I just have a representative sample. This is the 102 uh, Maksutov cast grain, and this is the 130 uh, reflector telescope. Um, this is just an overview of the Starseeker line, and I wanted to talk about the mount and how it works. Uh, I've got another video that goes really in depth on how to choose the different uh, tube that goes on top of the Starseeker. But let's just talk about the Starseeker mount itself. So the Starseeker is a altazimuth, up, down, left, and right, altazimuth, I should say, altitude and azimuth, uh, computerized go-to mount. So what that means is you uh, tell it what you want to see. The mount is fully robotic. It will go to the object, it will find it, it will center it, and then it'll continue to track it as it moves through the sky. So a very smart system. There are two ways to control the Star Seekers now. The, the Star Seeker has built-in Wi-Fi. So if you were to just get the base model, like let's say you just get the 102 Star Seeker, you download the free uh, app um, called uh, SynScan Pro on the uh, uh, Google Play Store or the uh, Apple App Store. Uh, and then you can control the mount with your phone. It's got a database of 40-some thousand objects uh, in the database. And you just tell it what you want to see, hit enter, it'll go find it for you. That's the easiest and uh, simplest way to uh, control the mount via your smartphone. The, the mount creates a little hotspot, a Wi-Fi hotspot. So you can be out in the middle of nowhere with no cell service and your smartphone will still connect to the uh, Starseeker mount to find objects in the night sky. The other way to connect is with the SynScan uh, hand controller. Now we sell packages with all of these mounts or with all of these telescopes that include the Starseeker hand controller. So you have your choice of no hand controller, connecting with the uh, Wi-Fi uh, and your smartphone, or getting the package with the SynScan controller. And then this will do everything as well. This has a database of 40 some thousand objects, punch in what you wanna see, it will go find it for you. I like the app best because it's got the most features. It's software related, so you can always add on more features. Uh, but the, if you didn't want to use your hand control, or if you didn't want to use your uh, smartphone for some reason, then you can use the hand controller to control the telescopes. All of the Star Seekers come with two eyepieces, a 23 millimeter and a 10 millimeter, uh, wide angle lenses, low power, high power, uh, to get you started. If you get one of the Mac designs, you get a 90 degree elbow, so you're looking down into it. Uh, with the reflectors, you're just always looking through the side uh, right into the focuser. And then on the side, you get the Easy Finder 2 finder scope to help uh, align the initial two alignment stars. Uh, once you do the alignment, uh, you don't really need the finder anymore because the computer is accurate enough to find everything for you. And like I said at the beginning, there are several different models in each uh, line of the Star Seeker. With the Max, we have a 102 millimeter seen here. There's a 127, a little bit larger, and then a 150 millimeter Mac. Those are the three Maksutov Cassegrains in the line. And then in the reflector line, we have three. This is the middle one, the 130. Uh, there's a smaller one, a 114 millimeter. And then on the other side, there's a bigger one, a 150. So that's basically four and a half inch, five and six. And I don't think I mentioned it over here. It's basically four inch, five inch and six inch Maxutovs. You'll have to decide what size you want. Uh, in general, the bigger uh, the diameter, the more light it lets in, the more resolution you've got. Uh, but you can check out my other video. It's uh, much longer and more in depth on the differences between the designs. All right, well, there you have it, the Starseeker line of telescopes, a robotic altazimuth system. Uh, you can buy it just the, the base uh, uh, telescope itself with no hand controller and then connect to your Wi-Fi uh, smartphone enabled, uh, your Wi-Fi enabled smartphone. Uh, and then you can also get the package that includes the SynScan controller if you would rather uh, connect via the controller instead of your smartphone. All right, thank you very much. Clear skies.